there were the traditional welcomes and ceremonies as New Zealand hosted this year's Asia-Pacific Economic Cooperation meetings. But for the second consecutive year, the COVID-19 pandemic meant those meetings were held virtually. The culmination was the Leaders' Summit, which resulted in a joint declaration, full of positivity around cooperation on the environment, economy and the pandemic. So where there may have been potentially in the past an opportunity uh, or uh, uh, an area where you may have seen forms of um, protectionism or nationalism in the response, you saw the opposite. A real commitment from APEC economies to overcome those issues. In normal times, it's the sideline meetings away from the spotlight where the big decisions and deals are made. In the virtual world, it's difficult to get a sense of any tension, but it was brought to the surface during a speech by China's President Xi Jinping to a CEO's summit the day before the leaders met. We should be forward-looking, move ahead and reject practices of discrimination and exclusion of others. Attempts to draw ideological lines or form small circles on geopolitical grounds are bound to fail. The Asia-Pacific region cannot and should not relapse into the confrontation and division of the Cold War era. His comments appeared to be in response to the United States' increasing military cooperation with regional allies including India, Japan and Australia, and came after years of trade tensions between the two countries. On Monday, President Xi will meet virtually with his US counterpart, Joe Biden. There are also issues around the trade pact known as the Comprehensive and Progressive Agreement for Trans-Pacific Partnership. All 11 members are also APEC members and now China wants to join. But so does Taiwan, which Beijing regards as a breakaway province that it will one day retake. There was of course no mention of that at this APEC summit, not publicly anyway. But despite the virtual nature of the meeting, there was still an opportunity for the tradition of the leaders posing in an item of clothing of the host's choice. Wayne Hay, Al Jazeera, Tauranga, New Zealand.